national priorities, which is affirmative action, development, project support, and operational excellence. Thank you. In that regard, capacity building becomes the key. The second one is to make sure that before accepting to host continental or international events, uh, federations uh, in a more logical uh, method. What it means to increase the grant that they are getting. On top of that, uh, we've got protests. Hey. The people in the front just put their hands on the that's he also accepted the recommendations of the commission, but uh, it persuaded us because of information which he gave us in the interest of the country to, to accept uh, the Springbok emblem with the protea for rugby and for rugby only. It would be required to reverse the motu, um, uh, But this was a special concession to rugby. And this special concession, like we see, I said, and like we said also to rugby, we can take it away from rugby if rugby does not fulfill certain things which we have listed. Below that level. So we are going to implement it. Even in this council today, there is a cry that the rugby has died in the, black, uh, in the black areas since unity. We have said, we, we've agreed with rugby that that must be addressed and that must be addressed urgently. The rugby must address the question of representativity. We have even put a target date that by come the Rugby World Cup in Wales, 1999, rugby must show a representative team. The amount of money that's available for allocation to everybody and it will only go some distance.